Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is a travesty playing some Neverwinter Nights 2 using the Return of the Exile mod. Alright, we are still wandering through the living district of Cordur. We're over here by this blacksmith, and I do have some things I want to sell. And I was going to do it off camera, but you know what? I got some items here that needed yes. to identify. And I figured it'd be kind of cool to let you guys see what all this stuff is. So I'm going to go ahead and talk to this blacksmith and deal with the uh, identification and sell and all this stuff like that. And once we get done with this blacksmith, I do want to check out a couple things here that we might have walked by, like this Sharp Ear Mansion. We haven't been in there yet, and there's this home over here that we haven't been in, and I think the way to get into here was through this small alley that was up in this area. So once we get done here, we'll check all this stuff out over here and then kind of circle around this way. And then I think we're going to head over here to this Temple of Pelor. We have a mission with uh, Walloran to go over there, so we'll deal with that. All right, let's go ahead and talk to the blacksmith. Let's see what he's got for us. Yeah, he's selling a bunch of plus one and plus two armors, but unfortunately I don't want to buy anything yet. I need seven grand yet for the main quest, so let's just sell whatever we can. Yeah, he won't buy weapons, but he should buy armor, yeah. And gems he won't buy, and no jewels. What about books? Nope, he won't buy books either. All right, is there anything else possibly here we can sell? All right, let's move what? on. Alright, chain shirt can go away. Yeah, he won't buy shields either. Alright, and I think that's all the armor that he's got besides the shields. What's going on? Alright, let's move on. We have some scale mail we can get rid of. Yeah, he won't buy any of this other stuff. No crafting stuff. And no ammo. Alright, that's okay. Yes. Alright, and we can sell that breastplate. And the rest of that stuff we're going to have to hold on to. Yes. All right, now we have some stuff that needs to be identified. Now, I'm thinking this is a bag of holding here. It looks like it is. Let's see. 100 coins to identify it. Let's see what it is. Yeah, it is a bag of holding. It reduces weight by 100%. That's one of the best bags for sure. Uh, let's actually keep that on Lorik. We have a short sword that needs to be identified. Ooh, this is a unique blade. A thigh du nag blade. It's a short sword, plus one, with an extra attack bonus, plus one, and it's alchemical silver. It's essentially a short sword, plus two, but it only does plus one damage. Hmm, maybe... Maybe Leoku can take advantage of that, although he's got the uh, dagger, plus two, which is a pretty decent weapon, too. Yeah, right now, it's plus seven, and seven damage. If I equip this, it's plus six and one extra damage. Hmm. They're both pretty good weapons, but I think I'm going to hold on to the dagger plus two. Maybe we can sell that thing. We'll see. All right, let's see. What Follow else me. do we have here? We have some rings that need to be identifi identified. Let's take a look. A ring of resistance giving us universal saves increase and orange light. And is this other one the same one? Let's take a look. Yeah, it sure is. Well, I guess we can probably give one of these to Walloran. Get his saves up. And maybe who else yes. has some low saves? Yes. Very well. Maybe we can give this other yes. one to Cyril. He's got a slot. What's going on? And he's yes. got a couple low yes. saves. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Let's give that to one, uh, Cyril. Get his saves up. Follow me. All right, let's continue on. We got a couple shields here. A light shield. And it's called Stout Ward. It is a light shield, plus two versus bludging and slashing. Hmm. All right, let's see what this other one is. A heavy shield. A shield of fortitude. Heavy shield plus two with bonus hit points. Ooh, that's a nice shield right there. Uh, let's see who could benefit Very from that the well. most. Maybe... Yeah, maybe we can give that to Lorik. Get his hit points up. Follow me. You know what? Let's do that. What? Let's give him that. It's going to raise his armor class to 24 and give him more hit points. And let's go ahead and re-hotkey all this stuff. All right, now yes. that other shield. What? Hmm. Yes. Yeah, currently Walloran's got the Footman's Folly, which is a light shield plus one with extra uh, armor class versus piercing. Hmm. I'm thinking I might want to keep that one, though, because it's a guaranteed plus two to his armor class. Whereas this one is just... It's a guaranteed plus one, but if he's ever dealing with piercing, it's only the plus one. 
It's still a good shield nonetheless. Hmm. Yeah, let's hold on to this one for now. Alright, and we have a couple books that need to be identified. Let's see what this is. A Shadow Friend's Book of Agility, Volume 1. Ooh, permanent plus one to dexterity. Ooh, that might benefit Walloran really well. He's got that negative dexterity here. It's only got one use. Let's see, is there yes. anybody else that could benefit? Yeah, Cyril can benefit from it. It'll give him an even number in dexterity, giving him an 18. Yes. Um... Yes. Leocle's got a nice one already with a 20. What's going on? Laura could probably, or Adaward could probably take advantage of it too, but to be honest, yes, I think it's going to benefit Walloran the most because he's got a negative. Yeah, once we use this, it'll bring his armor class to 22. Yep, you know what? Let's do that. Yep, there we go. Dexterity up to an even 10. His armor class is now 22. All right, that'll work. All right, and we have one more book here. What is this one? A book of leaves, only usable by druids and spirit shamans, and it does bark skin once a day. All right, that one yes. is obviously going Adaward. She's the only one that can use it for now. Follow okay. me. Okay. Yeah, uh, looks like we spent more money than we brought in, though, by selling that stuff. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. We can sell that skill armor, though. All right, well, we only have just over 3,500 coins. We need some more money. I don't want to buy anything just yet until we get that seven grand. For the main quest. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's go ahead and circle around here. Let's see if there's anything over here, and then we'll check out the Sharpier Mansion. We'll come over here and check this home, and then we're going to come down the street and head over to the Temple of Pelor. Alright, let's go. Oh, what's in here? Oh, it's nothing. Ooh. Edward's got something to say. So, this is a big city. I have to say, it looks intimidating. My whole life, I hadn't been out of the Druidic circles up in North Drintal, not until traveled north to Elster. I have to say, I never thought I'd see Cordur. You and me together, but we'll master the city fine, don't worry. Ooh, influence gain, up to 39 now. I wish I had your confidence, but at least I'm glad you feel like that. It makes me feel more secure. So, explore? Yes. Alright, I love them, uh barks and stuff like that. Alright, there's nothing back here, is there? No. Alright, let's see. Yeah, there's nothing there. Okay, let's just keep going. Uh, we should probably do a quick bit of healing too now. Let's go ahead. Santos. Get that sorted Let out. And let's way. use you one behind. add a word as Santos. well. And yes. let's use some more. Get them hit points squared away. All right, Leocul, let's go. All right, let's see who do we have over here. Cordur citizen, Hello. stay out of the dock, stranger. Dangerous place it is. All right, what is this? Two Castle Cypress and the Mages Academy. To the Market Square and the docks. All right, who's this guy up here? As you cross the city's main gates, there's a strange sensation growing into you. It's overpowering as you try to figure out what's going on. You fall to the ground as a stinging pain in your stomach takes place. You hear the voices of people around you, but you cannot really understand, for your ears are overcome with a high-pitched noise. You realize that you have no control of your actions, and then you lose your senses. Mm, look at these guys. Undead army. <laughs> We have been waiting patiently. We have been true to you. We have been worshipping you. What would be your orders, Master? Elimination of Halandrith and all that live in it. <laughs> How do you wish us to accomplish that, my lord? Tell us, and we do. Warriors you have been in your lives. Warriors you will be in your deaths. When we march, none will survive your cold steel. Do you wish any survivors, my lord? Anyone kept alive for some reason? <laughs> Dwarves shall die, humans shall die, elves shall die. All races shall perish when they meet my army. All. What if they fight us with magic? 
What if they bring their filthy clerics to destroy us? You only have to worry about landing your blades to their backs, infecting them with sickness and disease, feasting on their rotten flesh. Leave the rest to me. <laughs> the time of man has come to an end. The time of Halandrith and their beloved empire has come to an end. As the legions of the dead will fall upon them, they will be wishing that they'd be in hell. And as chaos reign, the kingdom shall burn in flames, and the world will be drenched in flames. For he leads us to our freedom, for he leads us to the glory. Let us not be forgotten again. We will be victorious. Follow me to the end, my minions. Follow me to your next death. In the end, I will bring you all back to enjoy the darkened world once again. One more of your dreams? We tried hard to wake you, but it was impossible to. Yes, I don't know what it means. It's kind of scary. I was commanding some undead forces this time. Is that possible that in a city this big, we will find some help on the matter? Perhaps in a local library or something like that. We'll see. Let's go explore the city a bit then. Hmm. All right. Dragons, undead armies. Wow, we got 200 experience points. Get anything else out of that? Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, let's keep going. All right, let's see if these guys know anything. Tra map transition up here. Keep safe and out of trouble. All right, attention citizens of Cordur, a wanted criminal will arrive in the city. Take extra care. Huh, <laughs> it must be referring to us. Weapons are allowed, but not sold. Visitors in Cordur, ask the guards for directions. Yeah, we already talked to them. All right, that's a map transition otherwise. Nothing else up there for us. There's a citizen. Oh, there's a named guy right here, a guy named Thokus. Let's talk to him. You see a man staring at a wall while he sighs often. His shoulders are down, and he looks rather sad. When you look at him a little longer, you see that he's not staring at the wall, but above it, and what is on the other side. He turns to you, surprised. May I help you, stranger? I had some questions. Go on, then. Why the sad face? Oh, just my troubles. I don't want to worry you, stranger. Maybe I can help. Hmm, okay, but... It's no big problem, but you see this building over there with a beautiful garden? This is the mansion of the Sharpier family. And I'm afraid I'm terribly in love with one maid they have. I saw her the other day while she was out to pick supplies. My heart skipped a bit, I tell you. <laughs> I don't see the problem, to be honest. Well, the Sharpiers are quite a family. They only talk about business and with other rich fellas that live in the quarter. So, I'm not really allowed to go in there and explain how I feel. If you want to help, you can go in there and say that you're looking for work, and mayhap you will find her and explain to her how I feel. Huh. Uh, actually, that sounds quite boring. <laughs> no, all right, I'll help you out. Thanks, stranger. I'll be here waiting for you. Hmm, I had some other questions. What can you tell me about this place? The quarter or the capital in general? The quarter. This is the main living quarter of Cordure, where most of the middle class is living. There are a couple of inns, some excitement on and off. We don't complain. If you want to learn something in specific, you need to ask the guards. They'll direct you. Yeah, we talked to them guys already. What about the capital? Ah, Cordure is the pride of all, Halandrith. Just look at the homes, designed by the famous architect Tupone are really a joy to behold. Then there is of course the market square where one can find goods from every corner of the world and the plains if you know where to ask. Hmm. And the best part is the Cypress Castle where the Imperial family lives. You have never seen anything like that. The gardens, so beautiful. Yeah, we were in that place already. All right, anything else? Who are you? Name is Thokus, born and raised in the capital. Proud of it. You look like you took a long journey. Where do you come from? Uh, we came from Elster in the north. Long story. 
Can I ask you something else? Alright, I guess that's it. Alright, so... Oh yeah, a sharp ear servant. Oh, there's another one over here, it looks like. Alright, let's see, we had a journal update. You met a man named Thokus by the entrance to the living square of Cordur. He said that he is in love with a maid from the nearby mansion, but he is not allowed entrance to speak to her. If you ask for work, maybe you'll be allowed to help him out. Alright. We can probably do that. I don't see anything else over here. Alright, let's take a look at this. Yeah, this is the Sharpier Mansion that I want to look at anyways. Alright, let's go. Sharpier Guard, will you let us in? State your business. Uh, I'm looking for work. There might be something for you. Come on in. Alright. All right, can we get in through here? All right. Yes. Mm, there we go. All right, this guy say anything else? I'm looking for work. All right, same thing. All right, this guard say anything? Yes. No. Elos Sharp Ear. Got another guard over here. Let's talk to this guy. Hi there, stranger. Are you new in the city, looking for work? I was actually only looking for an opportunity to sneak in and slaughter you and steal everything you have. <laughs> yes, that is the case. Then I might have something for you. Should I tell you the details? Yes, please. My family has a well in the backyard. It is our source of water since we don't really trust the city's water system. Some say it is pretentious, but what I say is work, make money, and build your own damn wells if you want. <laughs> in any case, the water has been contaminated. Something must have crawled in. Some kind of dire animal or carrion monster. I need you to climb down and eliminate it. After that, the water should be drinkable in a matter of days. I'll pay you for the job, of course. Alright, we'll be back when it's done. Alright, water pollution. Can you say anything else? Uh, let's see, I had some questions for you. I'll gladly answer anything you can. Can you give me some directions around the city? You'll have to ask the guards, boy. I don't leave my home very often. And therefore, I don't really know what's going on. <laughs> Alright. I'll be back later then. Sharp your guard. Alright, so it must be that well that we saw back there. But let's take a quick look over here. There's some children back here. Let's see if they know anything. Nope. Alright, and that probably goes back around there. Alright, let's take a look at the map. Alright, there is nothing else over here. Alright, there's a servant here. We talked to these guys already. And there's a servant here. This one's got nothing to say. This one looks female here. I'm not supposed to be speaking to visitors. If you'll excuse me. It's all right. I'm sure your master will be okay with it. What do you want of me? As I can see no other women around, I suppose it is you that the Focus guy was talking about. Focus? I don't know anyone by that name. If you look closely, you will see him peeping through the fence. He's in love with you. Saw you one day at the market and can't get his mind off you. The guy that followed me? I thought he had forgotten all about me. Oh, what a joy! <laughs> but my master, he will never approve of it. I think he will, once I get to talk to him. Don't worry. Hmm. Alright, looks like we're going to have to persuade the master to let her deal with him, huh? Alright, what do we have here in the crate? Notes for a song. Oh, is this a gift? Looks like it. Yep. Alright, let's grab that thing. All right, here's the well we need to get into. Let's see if this guy knows anything. Nope. And there is nothing else back here. Alright, let's go check out the well. Climb down the well? Yes, sir. Ooh. Shambling mound down here. Hmm, I'm not entirely sure if we can sneak attack this thing. Let's move into position. Target resisted all damage. 
Alright, let's go to sling. Alright, let's see if we can hit it with... Wow, we're doing barely any damage to it. Alright. Yeah, it's immune to sneak attacks. Just shoot it up anyways. Alright, let's see here. Let's maneuver a little bit. You keep shooting. Um... Alright, we got some bark skin coming up. Alright, and... Ooh, we gotta back her away. Alright, let's see. Do we have anything that might be useful here? Uh, I don't think any of this stuff is gonna help. Uh, let's just go for the shot. Alright, Lorik. Look what we have. Um, you know what? Let's fire up some bless real quick. Alright, and what else can we do? Let's do... Yeah, let's get some divine favor going on. And let's see, Walloran, what can we do with you? Um, you know what we can do. Let's give him some alchemist fire. And let's get that on his morning star. There we go. Should be able to do some fire damage now. Alright, let's see if we can move for a flank position here, maybe. Still doing all right. Come on, boys. Uh, looks like the rest. Oh, let's see, Lorik. All his damage is being, yeah, a good amount of it's being blocked. It looks like nothing I can do about it, though. Some of it is still going through, however. All right, fire damage is going through. Yeah, uh, well, and his damage too. Magic damage is going through. Hmm. Let's see. What else do we have that might do some more damage to this thing? Hmm. You know what? Let's get our animal companion fired up. And let's get some magic fang going on here. And... Let's go ahead and get another animal companion fired up. And let's get some magic fang fired up. Alright, we're still doing alright. Slowly doing damage. Alright, continue shooting that damn thing up. Alright, it's near death. Yeah, that's blocking all his damage. Come on, get him! Alright, let's bust out the blade. We're just wasting ammo here. And zero. Let's go to his spear. Come on, baby. We're still doing all right. Yeah, that's blocking all his damn damage. All right. All right, add a word. Maybe I can throw some acid on it. Do a little bit of damage to this damn thing. It's going to damage us too, but that's all right. There we go, got it. All right. Alright, journal update. You killed the monster that was nesting in the well and causing the pollution. Report to Elos. Okay. Alright, any goodies down here? Fall in behind me here. Nothing that I can see. Anything under the water? Yes, there is. Antidote and some gold. Let's grab all that. Any secret doors, possibly? Yes. Alright, I don't see anything here. We can't get in that part. 
don't see anything. All right, Very let's well. see. Let's go ahead and do a quick bit of healing. Some. What's going on? And let's see what we got left here. Let's get another one in there. Some. Let me lead the way. You follow behind. What? All right, and yeah, let's use up these Some. miners. Yes. Sanctus. What's going on? Sanctus. Fall in behind me. Right, that's going to be good, I think. All right. Let's get out of here. Climb up the well? Yes. All right. Let's close out this quest with old boy here and see if we can uh, persuade him to have his servant to deal with old boy outside. You're back. What happened? There was a monster nesting down there. It won't bother you anymore. Splendid news. Here, take this as a reward. And know that my home is open for champs like you. Alright, 350 experience points and 300 gold. Nice. Alright, I had some questions to ask. There's a love scene going on in your mansion. A woman servant and a man named Thokus are in love. I thought you should know. Are they now? And what should I do about it? I cannot have peasants dreaming about a better life, can I? <laughs> um, I think you should forbid it. <laughs> no, I don't want to do that. You can make an exception this time. They're good people. You accepted to assist me with my problem, so I'll take your words and trust you. I'll allow her to go visit him and settle the matter. Thanks again for your help, stranger. Alright, and we just got another th uh, 300 experience points and the alignment shift to good. Alright, does he say anything else? And Nope, we got all that information. Alright, let's see if she says something now that we persuaded him. Hey. Thanks again for your help. Focus is very nice to me. Okay. Alright, let's go talk to Focus. See if he says anything new now. Hi there. Thank you for your help, stranger. I really appreciate it. All right, did that quest actually close out? Yep. All right, good to go. All right, now. Yeah, let's walk back over this way and see what this home is, and then we're gonna head south toward the Temple of Pelor. Uh, Pelor. All right, and is there any more buildings over here we can get into? No. Alright, and there is nothing down here, is there? No, that goes back toward the blacksmith over there. Alright, let's come back this way. Alright, Cordoer Citizen. Well met. The sewers are blocked all the time, stranger. I hear strange things about this place. <laughs> the sewers, huh? Alright. This place is locked up. Let's see if we can't get into that. Ooh, success. Ooh, let's take a look. Where is this place? Ooh, it's right up here at the edge of the map. Alright, before we go in, let's see if there's something back here, maybe. Can we get back here? Yeah, we can. Kind of dark. And... Nope, there's nothing back here. All right, you know what? What? <laughs> Let's put up another light spell. Yes. Oh, let's make some space what? here so people can get Follow through me. here. Oh. Very well. And we're running up on time as well too. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get that light spell fired up. All right, let's see what's in here. Doesn't sound too good. There is a chest in here, though. I don't see anybody else. Looks like it's just some kind of storehouse or something. Let's check this place out pretty thoroughly. Oh. Where the hell did he come from? Oh, there's another one over here. Some thugs. Hmm. Alright, let's see if we can maneuver for a sneak here. Let's get this guy dead. Alright, Cyril, let's go back to your bow. 
I'm gonna shoot him up. And Alright, let's move Adaward back. She's gonna go back to her bow. Alright, shoot these guys up. Alright, he's near death and he's down. Alright, let's get this other guy over here dead. Alright, we were able to do some sneak attacks, that's good. Alright, got him. Alright, any traps on this chest? What's going on? I don't know, but let's see what's in these remains here. Two gold pieces! And more remains over here. A short sword, a healer's kit, and some gold. Alright, let's pass off the healer's kit. The rest of that stuff is cell material. Alright, any traps? Doesn't appear to be. 500 gold pieces, and like candy from a kid. Hmm. We just completed a quest, apparently. He found a stash of the merchant in the purple home. It was quite some gold, but with a price. More thugs had their eye on it, and it's quite possible your reputation grows amongst the ranks. Hmm. Maybe there was a quest we could have picked up somewhere else to rob this place. We got ahead of it, though. Alright, doesn't appear there's anything else in here. Let's get out of here. Alright. Let's see what's over this way. Alright, there's nothing in there. Um, yeah, there's nothing in there. Yeah, let's come back around here. This was the academy, uh... We were there before. We can't get in there, apparently. At least not yet. There was an alley over here we passed. That we haven't been down, and I think that goes over toward that home. Yeah, it looks like it. I want to see what's back here. All right, we are running up on time, though, so we're going to go ahead and explore that in the next episode. We'll see you then, ladies and gentlemen.